It's a beautiful day here in Waitomo, and out there is a typical New Zealand farming landscape. But apparently below the surface are kilometres and kilometres of caving systems, and I'm going to go below the surface and explore it all. The Waitomo Caves are one of New Zealand's tourist icons. They were discovered in 1887 by a local Maori chief, Tane Tinerau, and an English surveyor called Fred Mace. Tane and Fred floated into the caves on a flax raft and were blown away when they drifted into the now famous Glowworm Grotto. Later, Chief Tane found the entry point on land, the one that is still used today. The trip takes you through the cathedral, an amazing cavern filled with stalactites and stalagmites. These formations result from the thousands of years of water percolating through the cave. As the water drips from the cave roof, it leaves a tiny deposit of limestone, which eventually builds up to form a stalactite. And where it lands, it also grows up to form stalagmites. Just remember, tides come down, mites go up. But the highlight of visiting the Waitomo Caves is a boat trip through the Glowworm Grotto. It's a surreal experience floating silently through the darkness lit only by the pinpoints of the Arachna Campa Luminosa. That's glowworms to you. These glowworms are actually the larvae of a type of gnat and they emit light to attract food.